From Ravel, it is the Gone Fishing Set. The 1984 Bronco with the Bass Boat and Trailer Set Kit. It will be a reissue. And the Gone Fishing Set was initially released in 1991 with the Dodge Ram Charger. And then it was also reissued issued in 1991 as the Bass Busters set with the 78 Chevy El Camino. The Ford Bronco was initially released in 1981. There are optional parts in the kit to do a stock or custom on the Bronco. The bass boat is going to be a Ranger 363V Comanche bass boat. 157 parts molded in white and it is today's What's in the Box. Taking a look now at the body, you see it is a multi-piece body, molded in white. Get started with the frame parts tree, which also has the engine and wheel backs and some seat backs. Fortunately, some of the underside details molded to it. Fuel tank, part of the exhaust. Well, excuse me, fuel tanks, part of the exhaust. Then we have the engine, halves, steering column, air cleaner, steering wheel. Over this corner, we have the other wheel backs. Spare tire carrier, radiator. Moving on now to the next part street. This one has some suspension pieces, some interior pieces, some body pieces. Here we have the hood and the front seats. This one we have the front axle, springs, shocks, radiator shroud dash and here we have the rear axle spare tire transfer case white pipe for the exhaust and here we have the interior tub fair amount of detail on the door panels no little detail on the underside and here we have the rear seat with the roof rack with the skis. Moving on to the last parts of the tree here for the Bronco. We have the fender flares, fuel can, winch, roll bar. Not sure what these pieces are for just yet. And the rear half cap, whatever, we, whatever it's called. Now we're going to take a look at the bass boat, which is done in two pieces, top and bottom. Start with the top. Fair amount of detail on top. And we'll take a look at the bottom part, the side, or the hole. Now we're going to take a look at the boat parts tree, or the main parts tree anyways. So you have your outboard. Your seats, steering wheel, whatever we're calling this piece here. And then here we have the Yamaha outboard. And here we have the steering wheel, the seats, trolley motor, the dash with the gauges. Now we're gonna take a look at the main trailer parts tree. For the most part, this is just a generic trailer, not even an accurate boat and trailer. It's more like a car trailer that was made into a boat trailer, not based on anything. And then here's the trailer hitch again, not really a, a based on anything really. And then here you have your rear axle. And 
Then we have the wheels, wheel backs, and a storage compartment. And then the pieces the boat sits on. Take a look now at the chrome parts trees. We're going to start with the Bronco parts tree. So you have your set of wheels, stock and custom, the custom here, the mags, stock down there. Yeah. The front uh, grill guard with some driving lights, off road lights, it's grill, bumpers, rear view mirrors, some engine pieces. And this parts tree is going to be for the boat, and various boat pieces. And in the middle there, right there is the, uh, be the ball, toll ball, ditch ball. Now we're going to take a look at the clear parts of the trees. On the left we have for the Bronco, your, your windows, headlight lenses, taillight lenses. On the right you have the windows for the boat, or the windscreens I guess we'll call them. Now we're going to take a look at the roundy rounds, four for the Bronco four for the trailer, all generic blank sidewall tires. Now moving on to the decal sheet, which is pretty nice and colorful actually. Looks like a nice decent sheet. A lot of decals on there you have for both the Bronco and the Bass Boat. Top side you have striping for the Bronco. Bottom side, you have shopping for decals for the boat. A couple of uh, license plate choices, both Wisconsin and Ontario. They have both Bronco and trailer license plate decals, so that's nice that they included that. Now we're going to take a look at the instruction book. So that's what those pieces were. They were for the roof rack. Step 34. That uh, makes sense. And yes, if you want to get yourself some Ford Bronco color match paint, no doubt James and his skill finishes can get some mixed up for you. So that, my friends, is going to do it for this look at the Revell 1984 Bronco with bass, boat, and trailer set. It's the Gone Fishing Kit. So on that note, thank you guys for watching.